Blessings, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. This is the word of the day. This video that I am making today will be the most important video that you will ever watch in your entire life. Today, I'm going to go over what it means to be saved with everything that's been going on in our world. And now we have just gone through the pandemic and now a possible World War III beginning. Now is the time to call on Jesus Christ to be your personal Lord and Savior. You are not promised your next breath. In fact, every one of us can die at any moment. And what happens when you die? Well, the Bible tells us that if you are not saved by the blood of Jesus Christ and what he did on the cross, then you will go to hell and spend it there for eternity. Now, the Bible tells us in Romans 3.23 that all have sinned and have fallen short of the glory of God. Now, what does that mean that you have sinned? Well, I'll explain it to you very simply. Have you ever lied to anyone? Have you ever stolen anything? Have you ever used the Lord God's name in vain? Have you ever looked at another human being with lust in your eyes for them? These are all sins. This is uh, only four a part of the Ten Commandments that are found in the Holy Bible. So yes, you are a sinner, and I have just proved it to you. Now, what is the solution? Well, God sent Jesus Christ to die on the cross for your sins. He paid that sin debt, but you have to accept it. You have to call on Jesus Christ in order to receive this salvation. The Bible tells us in Romans 10, 13, it says, Everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. Now, the Bible also tells us in John 14, 6, this is Jesus speaking. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes unto the Father except through me. In other words, you cannot go to heaven and be with God Almighty except through Jesus Christ. Now, it also tells us in Acts 4, 12, salvation is found in none other than Jesus. For there is no other name under heaven given among men by which we must be saved. So in other words, Jesus is the only way that you can get to heaven. So if you believe in Buddha, if your faith is in Judaism, Hinduism, Islam, Taoism, Zoroasterism, Confucianism, Chinese folk religion, paganism, African religions, or Wicca, or any other of the different religions that are in the world, you are lost. The Bible is clear. Jesus is the only way that you can get to heaven. Now, there's one thing that I want to point out to you also. There are over 10,000 prophecies found in the Holy Bible. Many have come true and many more are to be fulfilled. Now, what are the chances of even one of these prophecies coming true? They are astronomical, but yet hundreds, even thousands have already come true. And there's no disputing that. So if they are found to be true, these prophecies that have been made and the ones that are coming true, and it also says that Jesus is the only way to get to heaven, well, that must be true also. So I'm telling you that Jesus Christ is the only way that you will be able to get to heaven. And it's up to you. If you think this life is hell on earth, as they say, it is nothing compared to the hell that is coming after this life. And you don't have to go there. You have the choice. You can decide where you're going to go. And simply all you have to do is call on Jesus Christ to be your Lord and Savior. 